Hello. Um, today we're going to see how to solve second degree equations. So a second degree equation uh, of x is an equation that looks like a x squared plus bx plus c equals zero. And you have to replace a, b, and c with actual numbers. So an example would be minus 2x squared plus 3x minus 1 equals zero with a being minus 2, b being 3, and c being minus 1. So that's a second degree equation. Solving this equation is very easy and straightforward. First thing you have to do is to calculate delta. Delta equals b squared minus 4ac. In, in this case, it equals b squared minus 4 times minus 2 times minus 1. So that's 9 minus 8. That's 1. So delta equals 1. So really, all you need to do is figure out what a, b, and c are, and replace in this formula here, and you'll find delta. Now you have three cases. The first case is delta is strictly positive. Second case is delta is equal to zero, and third case, delta is strictly negative. In our case, we have delta equals one, that's strictly positive. So we can calculate the two solutions. First solution is minus b plus square root of delta over 2a. And I've calculated this uh, for you here, and we have the first solution, that's 0.5. Second solution, the same as the first one, except that you replace the plus here by a minus here. And you'll get the second solution, that's 1. I've plotted this equation uh, here on, on the green curve. And you can see that it intersects this axis on x equals 0.5 and x equals 1. So that shows you. Um, visually uh, where you can find the solution. Now, I've plotted another uh, equation, x squared plus 2x plus 1. Uh, and if you want to solve for this, you'll find that delta equals 0. And you can see here that there's only one point at which the red curve crosses uh, this axis. So in this case, uh, the solution is even simpler. It's minus b over 2a. So here, uh, b is uh, 2, and a equals 1. So minus b over 2a is minus 1. And you can see that here being x equals minus 1. And the third possibility is that delta is strictly negative, in which case you can uh, look very hard, but you will not find a solution, because there is no such solution for delta strictly negative. So remember, if you find something that looks like a x squared plus b x plus c equals zero, all you need to remember is this little uh, cheat sheet, and you can also print it if you want to keep it for further uses. So see you later. Bye bye.